The Stu Gray Selling Hurdle is next. And this is a two and a quarter mile naught to 90 handicap hurdle, so quite low rating for this. So these are the ones I obviously didn't do well last week. The top one is Mandolin Nata for James Shea, Lawn Wave, Thomas Rogers, Kluger Stu Gray, Linda's Nessa. Or Thomas Rogers, Tom's Return, Obi-Wan, Trojan Bridge, Martin Lido and Regents Ford, James Shea. Called in then, and away. And short one to the first, which they're all safely over nicely with Tom's Return on the inside. Just a little bit. Three of them gone on and as they race towards the second of the 11, which they're all safely over. And it's Tom's Return in the yellow from Lawn Wave and Manolin Nata. Then comes Regents Ford back in. Third with um, Trojan Bridges, they get over number three, which they're all safely over as well. Already, one or two of them are getting a little bit detached. So, either the pace is very hot, or one or two of these are very poor. We'll soon find out later in the season. But past the winning post, then with a circuit to go, it's Tom's return in the yellow in the lead from Lawn Wave in second, then Mandolin Nata is third, and a gap of about three lengths back to Trojan Bridge, and then Regents Ford, and the back to Linda's Nessa and Kruger or Kluger are well out of shot so they're already really strung out then and coming down to fin uh, flight number four which they all skip over I presume the last two have got over them okay as well a short run to the fifth which they all get over as well there Tom's return then clearing the lead by two lengths to Lawn Wave second Manolin Nata a similar distance back in third Similar sort of gap back to Trojan Bridge with the Regents Ford Rod right on that one's tail. And Linda's Nessa and Kluger. Well, make your own guess as to how far back they are. Maybe we'll see them in a panned out shot shortly, but they don't appear to. Oh, there's one of them. Here comes uh, Linda's Nessa. I don't know where Kluger is, but it doesn't look like Stu Gray is going to be winning his own race at this moment in time. They're in true Indian file now, then. And it's Tom's return who's clearing the lead. On Lawn Wave second, Madeline Nata third, Trojan Bridge fourth, Regents Ford is after that, Linda's Nessa is after that one, and then Kluger is somewhere. So, probably isn't a race that's going to take a lot of winning this, but whether any of these will win again this season remains to be seen. I'm not sure where you go after a 0 to 90 hurdle. There's not many places left as they get over number six. And Tom's return is in the lead. Long way with Madeline Nata and Trojan Bridge back in fourth as they take the seventh, which they all get over nicely. And Tom's return. Had it all his own way so far, clearing the lead. Takes the eighth, which all those in shot got over nicely. Kluger presumably jumped it okay as well. We've got three more flights to take. And Tom's return is two and a half lengths clear of Lawn Wave is being pushed along. Trojan Bridge is moving to third. Then Madeline Nata is fourth, and then Regents Ford after that, and then Linda's Nessa. And somewhere Kluger. As they race around this turn. Four furlongs left, and two or three flights still to go. And Tom's return is now four and five lengths clear. Looks so he's already going for home. Trojan Bridge is trying to move into second. Lawn Wave has been pushed along by the jockey there and is maintaining second at this stage. Then Regents Ford, Linda's Nessa as they get over the ninth three from home. And the jockey on Tom's return already having a little look behind to see where the rest of them are. Over the second last, and he's still four or five clear. Trojan Bridge finally gets into second but immediately surrenders it back to Lawn Wave. Then Linda's Nessa and Regents Ford. Coming down towards the final flight then, and Tom's return skips over it in the lead, but now suddenly Lawn Wave is throwing down a challenge, and Linda's Nessa is willing to close as well. Tom's return suddenly got a race on his hands as they race into the final half furlong, and a race that looked like it was nothing is now turning into a real ding dong as they race up towards the line, and Linda's Nessa has taken it. Never looked like winning anywhere other than at the line, and Kluger actually have a top one as well. So a bizarre end to a pretty uneventful race. I mean, three in a line. Coming towards the post. And Linda's Nessa is a 1 2 for Thomas Rogers. Linda's Nessa first, Lawn Wave second. Tom's return back in third for Obi Wan, led pretty much all the way. Trojan Bridge for Martin Linden was fourth, and Regents Ford for James Shea was fifth.